Now to the Trump presidency. President Trump made a public appeal for a wall along the U.S.-Mexico border during a primetime address last night. Today, he's trying to win support for the proposal from lawmakers. CBS 4's Nicole Killian is live in Washington, D.C. with the latest. Nicole. Hey, good afternoon to you. And it's unclear whether or not President Trump changed any minds up here on Capitol Hill, but the White House says he is ready to negotiate. President Trump heads to Capitol Hill today for lunch with Republican senators as he pushes for a southern border wall. My administration has presented Congress with a detailed proposal to secure the border and stop the criminal gangs, drug smugglers, and human traffickers. It's a tremendous problem. The president has told Congress he will not sign any bill to end the partial government shutdown unless it includes $5.7 billion in wall funding, which was a signature campaign promise. At his rallies, he chanted, who will pay for the wall? And people scream back, Mexico. Democrats accused the president of manufacturing a crisis on the border. Alaska's Lisa Murkowski has become the third Republican senator to break with the president and call for an end of the shutdown down before addressing border security. She says thousands of furloughed government workers are worried about their next check and adds there is no reason they should be held hostage to a political dispute. The White House says it's not worried about losing support from Republican lawmakers. I'm concerned about the fact that we have a crisis at the border that we need to solve and we need Democrats to step up, do their jobs and work with us to get it done. House Democrats are pushing to reopen federal agencies one by one and separate the shutdown from the border wall. They'll vote on bills to reopen two agencies today and two more tomorrow. But Senate leader Mitch McConnell says he will not allow those bills to come to the Senate floor unless President Trump agrees to sign them. Now, after his lunch with Senate Republicans here on Capitol Hill, President Trump will return to the White House for another meeting with congressional leaders, including Democrats. Live on Capitol Hill this noon, Nicole Killian, CBS 4 News.